Ann says he spent his summer preparing to be a Clark County school teacher, only to have the job offer pulled out from under him. 13 Action News reporter David Schumann is here with more on why it didn't work out. David. What struck me the most about this man's story was that he went through all this while Clark County is enduring a teacher shortage. He says the district retracted his full-time teaching offer, offer and never explained why. I'm all excited. I'm getting ready, preparing lesson plans out of my own time. Joe Minnick wanted to bring his years of theater experience to Cheyenne High School this fall. He's acted, directed, and taught theater before, all of which seem to be going in his favor. He offered me the job on the spot. Joe says Cheyenne's principal then told him the district would be in touch with all the paperwork. And most importantly, a contract offer. None of that ever came. Joe says it was five weeks after the initial offer when the principal called with a different offer, one that left Joe confused. Take the job as a substitute. I felt a slap in the face saying, saying, uh, we don't, we don't value you. Joe turned down the position. They wanted me to do all the work as a teacher, just not pay me as a teacher. We asked the school district about the situation. They gave us a statement saying they always encourage all applicants to follow up on their application status and with the HR division. Joe says what happened to him doesn't make much sense considering what the district is going through. And I heard about this teacher shortage. I said, well, I want to make a difference. I'll apply to be a teacher. Joe has found work as a freelance graphic designer and has some interviews lined up with private schools. Meanwhile, Clark County has more than 300 teaching vacancies to fill. David Schumann, 13 Action News. Thanks, David.